are you looking for a quick roundup of the week's technology news and images? Well, good news, I've just found it. Let's go! Some epic news for Star Wars fan. Disney has just announced there will be a new Jedi trilogy, and this will be the fourth trilogy to be released since 1977. We're starting to doubt whether the saga will actually be over one day. It's official! Twitter has finally allowed all of its users tweets of up to 280 characters at a time. Another piece of official news, some people are already sick of it. Some troublemakers have now created a plugin for Chrome which allows you to go back to the original 140 character tweet on Twitter. The shorter the better. Over at Instagram, we will soon be able to follow hashtags. 10 days after its launch in France, Orange Bank is already a success. 30,000 accounts have been opened so far. It's a great success for the main food network in France as they get in on the action. And on Facebook, guess what? You can now transfer money to your friends through Messenger. Yes, it's the main news of the week. Money transfers among friends have arrived on Messenger, the Facebook messaging service used by over 1.2 billion users. They've been testing it for over two years in the United States and the social network has announced that they will bring the option of paying with one click to Europe and it should work perfectly once users have entered their bank details. Makes sense. At the moment, it can only be used to transfer money within the same country, but the option will soon be available everywhere. And if you forget who you owe the money to, M, an assistant that is rich in AI and technology, will sort you out. It works as a wallet and a reminder at the same time. Not bad. Good news for the pop world. The first album composed entirely using artificial intelligence has just been released and unsurprisingly, it's called I am AI. The human behind this idea is called Taryn Southern. And for her new album, the American musician has cleverly decided to put her trust in Amper, a computer intelligent enough to make music by itself. Admittedly, music and robots are nothing new, but this is the first time people are putting machines to use to create augmented music. Questions. Who will they send to the Grammy Awards if AI wins an award? And what will happen if Daft Punk are named in the same category? So many questions. See you guys next week.